Put this thing on. All right. Hey, y'all. So, uh, who he? Uh, he asked me to watch this there movie called, uh, In Them There Tall Grass. Um, it's supposedly by, uh, What's that fella's name? Um, his name's, uh, Joey, Joe, Joe Hill? Yeah, so, him, Paul, writes books, and, and he's kind of obsessed with them, so, uh, he asked me to watch it, he said, he said, ain't no way that the movie could be as good as that there book. And, uh, I don't know about all that, because y'all know I don't read them words, <laughs> uh, what was I saying? Oh yeah, uh, the movie. So, uh, me and Brenda, Brenda made us up some biscuits, and, and I sat down and I watched that there movie. Um, so the movie is about somebody that ain't done cut their grass in a long time. And it got me thinking about that one time when, uh, when I got myself some new, uh, hair trimmers. And, uh, and, and Brenda done broke them things trying to shave her, you know, trying to shave, she, she read one of them cosmopolitan, cosmopolitan, one of them women's magazines, and they said that men's like it when you shave your nether regions, and I said, no. No, what is you doing, Brenda? And Brenda was like, Oh, you don't understand. It makes me more attractive. I was like, No, girl, no. You look you look like you got a butt in the front. <laughs> like you got a front butt. <laughs> it, she, she didn't take kindly that butt whatsoever. See, you got to lift up all that lady meat just to get down there. So it's almost like... You, I didn't even know about it at first. I lifted up. I'm like, oh, Lord Jesus. I thought she had chicken pox. She was all bumpy with, uh, with them zits and whatnot. And shit, I wasn't, I wasn't going to go down there. Y'all tell y'all the truth. I wasn't going to go down there. Uh, but then she got a, 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 a bottle of, of, uh, of a butter flavored syrup. And I did my husbandly duties. <laughs> yeah. Um, what, what the hell was I talking about? But, uh, hang on here. Uh, we watched, uh, something about some grass. You ever smoke grass? I have. Man, one time I smoked grass, I ate 12 dozen of Brenda's biscuits. I also didn't need syrup that night, if you know what I mean. <laughs> uh, but, uh, yeah, so we watched that movie, and one of them, one of them ladies in the movie, she got pregnant by her brother or something, I don't know, but... She gets lost in the grass with her brother, and she's got she got a baby on board. You know how them hippies out in California got the, the things on the back of their cars. It says baby on board. I'm like, better get him off the board. What you think he is, a pizza? <laughs> but no, no, just quit joking, Earl. Uh, okay, so you got a baby, and they end up all different kinds of places, but they all in the grass. You see what I mean? There's some uh, there's some foreshadowing. There's four of them shadows, uh, and when they drive in, they drive by a bowling alley, and me and Brenda used to go bowling all the time, but we don't go bowling no more, because she says she prefers to stay home and play with balls. <laughs> that ain't true. She don't like my balls. She said it smells like a, like a crime against humanity down there. She's always asking me, what do I clean myself with? Roadkill? <laughs> I'm like, <laughs> No, no, I don't clean myself with roadkill. I don't even quite get that joke. But anyway, so we watched this movie, and they got lost in the grass, and then time got all weird. Like at one time, I drank too many margaritas and fell asleep on my sister. On my sister, not in my sister. I'm country. I ain't that country. But uh, I fell asleep on my sister, and my sister's knocking on well, you like that way? You like that sound when it changes when you got your mouth open? <laughs> um, but I woke up on my sister. I was like, what happened? She said, you drank too much tequila. And I said, no, I had me margaritas. And she goes, I don't care who you sleeping with. You're my brother. And I, we just got confused. Um, so we're watching this movie, and they end up in a bowling alley. And in the bowling alley, they end up on the roof. 
And that's pretty much the whole movie. They on the they on the roof. Now whoa, they found out themselves some uh some um some um some some um some guys with butthole faces. Uh I think it was supposed to be like swirling grass or whatever, but looked like they had a butthole for a face. Yeah, him got a butthole for a face. And that was pretty much I think a metaphor uh, a metaphor metaphor. That was a metaphor for the whole movie. Was he, if you got a butthole for a face, you probably need to live deep in, in, in some tall grass or something. I don't know. But they found this rock, and then the preacher man, he got all preachified, and uh, and he's like, oh, God and did this, and then he, he fed the lady some barbecue on the ground. Just sloppy, wet barbecue. I ain't too fan. I ain't too much in love with wet barbecue. And, uh, 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 sorry, he, I got stuck. But he fed he fed her some barbecue, and it was some of that uh, some of that uh, uh, some of that wet barbecue. You know, not not like a Memphis good old Memphis dry rub. Y'all know what I'm talking about, man. If I'm gonna put sauce on some barbecue, I'm gonna put it on after the fact. You know what I mean? Real Southern boys, they don't put sauce on their barbecue. Uh, they they put syrup on they women's. <laughs> yeah, that ain't no joke. That's the truth. Um, but it's got to be butter flavored, like a biscuit. You know, it kind of looked like a biscuit down there. You know, the product. If, if your woman's got a pat of butter down there, you know you done something right in my right, <laughs> All right, so I guess I don't uh, I don't watch that movie. So uh, that's all I gotta say about that there movie. Uh, I'm not sure if he's going to talk about that there movie, but he said he's going to talk about the book, the, the book with that book in the book, whatever that means, but he says that's coming real soon. Speaking of coming real soon, I'm going to go see about Brenda's biscuit. <laughs> Y'all have a good one. Yeah.